Kenya waliungana na ulimwengu mzima kuadhimisha siku ya kifua kikuu duniani huku serikali ikihimizwa iwekeze zaidi katika kuzuia uh, kuliko kutibu ugonjwa huo waziri wa afya mutahikagwe kwenye hotuba iliyosomwa kwa niaba yake na mkurugenzi wa matibabu na huduma za dharura daktari Andrew Mulwa alisema kwa serikali inanuia kutoa asilimia 38.5 ya dawa za kifua kikuu kwa wakenya kufikia mwaka 2024 baada ya kuchukua jukumu la kununua tiba hizo zilizokuwa zikitolewa na wafadhili gavana wa Machakos daktari Alfred Butua alihimiza serikali kuu iwekeze zaidi katika kuzuia kifua wa kikuu ili kuangamiza ugonjwa huo humo nchini. Kauli mbiu ya mwaka huu ilikuwa wekeza ili kuangamiza kifua kikuu. Nusuru maisha. The programmatic management of multiple uh, of drug resistant TB is exclusively supported by global fund and as a government we are developing frameworks that will adopt other aspects of the programmatic management of uh, drug resistant tuberculosis for direct support by the exchequer. Your Excellency, through the Global Fund support, we are able to put all clients with multiple drug resistant TB under NHIF cover so that they are able to access uh, health services uh, without uh, incurring catastrophic health expenditure. We are not only celebrating about finding treatment for tuberculosis, but talking about finding treatment for preventive diseases from all over the world. We really need our people to be educated about tuberculosis. It is not a death sentence. Advocacy and awareness have to continue. But these ones also have to go hand in hand with proper treatment. So the revolution of healthcare has been critical, especially in ensuring that our people are getting treated.